a man beat and threatened to kill his wife and mother before kidnapping his wife and leading officers on a car chase Thursday, according to the Orlando Police Department. Kevin Anderson, 36, of Orlando faces several felony charges, including kidnapping, aggravated battery with a weapon, and fleeing and eluding. He's being held without bond at the Orange County Jail. Shortly after 1 a.m. Thursday, police responded to an Orlando fire station, where they found Anderson's mother. She told officers that Anderson showed up at her Wind Hover Drive condominium with his wife and then lay down. Anderson's mother told police she asked what was going on, which angered him because he thought he was getting thrown out. Anderson left and seemed unstable, according to charging documents. Anderson and his wife went to the parking lot, where he asked her to get in the car. She refused, according to an arrest affidavit. He became enraged after noticing his mother standing in the doorway. Documents show Anderson walked toward his mother with a gun in his hand, saying, I should kill you, before dropping the gun and hitting her in the head. Anderson then put his wife in a headlock and started punching her before pushing her down two flights of stairs and forcing her into his car, police say. Officers soon located the car and began a pursuit. The car crashed into a brick wall near the intersection of Clarkona Okoe Road and Lake Sparling Road and Anderson and his wife were detained, according to documents. Police noticed several cuts and bruises on his wife's face. The wife told police that during the drive, Anderson called her a whore before threatening to stab her, burning her with a cigarette, and hitting her with a baton and box cutter. Authorities soon discovered that Anderson had a warrant out for his arrest in connection with a December incident in which he's accused of shooting at his father. The December.8 incident started when Anderson showed up at his father's house, upset that his ex-wife had spent the night there. Anderson's father told him to leave and not come back without some personal items that the ex-wife needed, according to court documents. Anderson walked to his car, opened the door and said, I'll show you, before pointing a black handgun at his father and firing four shots, the victim told police. Three shots hit vehicles in the driveway, and the other shattered a neighbor's glass door. Anderson faces several charges including attempted murder and aggravated assault with a firearm in connection to the December shooting. Michael Williams can be reached at mewilliams at orlandocentinel.com, 407-420. 5022 or at Michael Damien. Interactive map, every homicide in Central Florida. An Okoe police officer was not justified in shooting into a home in the middle of a 2016 night after a dispatcher sent him to the wrong address for a domestic disturbance, an Orange County jury ruled Thursday. An Okoe police officer was not justified in shooting into a home in the middle of a 2016 night after a dispatcher sent him to the wrong address for a domestic disturbance, an Orange County jury ruled Thursday. An Okoe police officer was not justified in shooting into a home in the middle of a 2016 night after a dispatcher sent him to the wrong address for a domestic disturbance, an Orange County jury ruled Thursday.